Okay, this is lesson 3.8, Unions and Intersections of Sets, on page 215. Problem 1, Union of Sets. In your left pocket, you have a quarter, a paper clip, and a key. In your right pocket, you have a penny, a quarter, a pencil, and a marble. What is a set that represents the different items in your pockets? So if we write the left pocket, remember the notation for sets is those squiggly little parentheses. Um, so in your left pocket, you have a quarter, paper clip, and a key. We're just going to list those. In the right pocket, we've got the set of the penny, the quarter, the pencil, and the marble. Okay? Write the union of the sets. Union just means what are all the different items. So what that means is you're not going to list the same thing twice. So even though you have a quarter in both pockets, you're only going to say quarter once. So you have a quarter, a paper clip, a key, a penny, a pencil, and a marble. Even though you technically have two quarters, we only write that once. Okay? So the got it. A. Write sets P and Q below in roster form. And what is P union Q? Okay? So roster form means list. So X is a whole number less than 5. Whole numbers include 0. So 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. It doesn't say less than or equal to 5, it says less than 5. So P is the set 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Q is an even natural number less than 5. Okay, and I blew that because 0 is not a natural number. Sorry. So um, the even natural numbers less than 5 would be 2 and 4. Um, so if we're looking for their union, the 2 and the 4 they have in common, but we're only going to put those once. So really, basically, since the 2 and 4 are in here, this is our union. This, this original set is our union because both of these are part of that. Um, which answers question B. What is true about the union of two distinct sets if one is a subset of the other? Well, Q was a subset of P because all of its members are in here. So the union of two distinct sets is the list of um, items on both sets. So if one is already a subset of the other, then the larger is the union. And that's exactly what we showed right here, that P and P union Q are the exact same thing because Q was already in P, and we don't have to list those twice. 